I'm starting my third trip. I'm heading down to uh, the South Sound to take part in the St. Louis 100. Randy was going to join me, but because of unforeseen circumstances, he can't make it. So I'm solo down to uh, Olympia. And from there, I'll tie in with the group for the Salish 100. And then after that, Port Townsend, I'll uh, solo back home. So anyway, that'd be my third trip. Should be a fun one. And there's my home port. And a nice shot of turtle back now. So I left uh, this morning around nine o'clock and I was supposed to leave around five in the morning. Uh, so the currents are totally against me. They have been the whole way, the wind and the current, and I knew they would be. I just couldn't get moving this morning. So anyway, I'm heading over to Bowman Bay over by Deception Pass. But the currents are their strongest a little bit after three. They're gonna be almost three knots. And so, I'm going to wait till around 4 or 4.30 to head south, so the currents will be a little weaker. And uh, the wind will be on my nose, and the current will be on my nose, but I'm hoping I can sail there. It may just take a while, I have to do several tacks. But anyway, in the meantime, I'm going to go ahead and bake some bread. Okay, so I turned up the heat once I realized the other bottle was out, and uh, we got it. Oh. It's, it's, I'm trying to brown it now, so it's pretty much big. Okay, there we go. There's the top. It's looking pretty good. So now then, let's get the bottom, or actually, yeah, the bottom done. So I'll give it a couple minutes. How you bake bread on a 17-foot sailboat. I have Bowman Bay completely to myself. There's not another boat here. It's hard to believe it's such a beautiful spot. Snow Goose came by and said hi uh, on this beautiful day. It's been pretty quiet. He's probably about the seventh or eighth boat I've seen. Right now I'm motoring against the uh, wind and the current. And I'm heading into Oak Harbor to get some uh, gas and then I gotta make a
Baker greeting another day in the beautiful Pacific Northwest. My early morning boat breakfast, the sound of the outboard booming. So after 35 miles and over seven hours motoring, uh, I finally caught some wind and I'm about seven miles from the northernmost marina in Seattle and that's where I'm going to spend the night. So and then tomorrow I'll cross over to Port Madison on Bainbridge. This is uh, Point Defiance and Ruston Waterway. And uh, it's a really beautiful spot just outside of Tacoma. And uh, it's got a very nice park that you can walk along, which goes down to a, a nice little area that has restaurants and fountains. And it's just a beautiful area. So why walk down when you can relive your youth? Whoa! I stopped at Point Defiance today, which is uh, outside of Tacoma, on uh, the north side of uh, Tacoma Narrows. I'll go in the Narrows tomorrow. Uh, Bob Brown went by and uh, I'm gonna go over to his boat. He's at the Tacoma Yacht Club. Well, I just came over and had a really nice barbecue dinner with uh, Bob on his no goose. So it's a very enjoyable evening. some great skating. Oh, Thanks. thank you so much. Lots of practice.
So I've been waiting for the early afternoon to leave Point Defiance Marina. I had to wait for the current to change in uh, Tacoma Narrows. And it changed about 30, 35 minutes ago. So I'm gonna go through the Narrows and then I'm not sure where I'll end up tonight. I was talking to Chris on the phone and uh, <laughs> totally went past where I was going to be staying. So I lucked out because there's only two buoys on this island and uh, the one on the other side where it'll stay sunny or longer was taken. But I had to turn around and backtrack and uh, the buoy on the opposite side is still open so I'm going to go to Eagle Island for the night and uh, head towards Olympia tomorrow. I'll be looking out on Mount Rainier, which is a spectacular view of it. And this is a small island, but it really is a beautiful little island. So it's a great place to spend the night. Boat of my dream. If I could have any boat, that would be it. Love this place. Well, there's the state capitol. I'm here at Swantown Marina for the Salish 100. And the boats are just starting to arrive. A few arrived last night like I did. But uh, this afternoon, this should be pretty full. 